Hello guys and welcome back to Let's Play Mor uh, Morrowind Tribunal. Well, it is technically Morrowind, but it's Tribunal. It says on the box, Elder Scrolls 3 Tribunal. So, that's what we're doing. And we last left off, we were shooting guys in the head. With arrows. I don't know what our hit ratio is. It's probably not very high. Ah. Uh, it's it's good that oh, oh oh no he's running away come back. This reminds me of playing thief. Have you did you ever play thief? I used to play thief. I haven't played thief in a long time. I want to do a let's play of thief. That would be cool. But I don't have the CD. It's uh, I think it's at my parents' house actually. There's a whole bunch of stuff that I need to pick up from there. I moved out of my parents' house about, what, five years ago? <laughs> and there's still stuff there. In fact... Mm, there's not too much. Aha, marksman has increased. I mean, goodness sake, it's about time it increased. Well, this guy's got the right... Oh, no, it doesn't. I thought he was going to have the right idea, but... Oh, maybe he's going to have the right idea. Maybe he's the one that's going to do something proper. No. He was nearly there. He was almost thinking about it. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. This is what I'm talking about. I wouldn't stand there if I was you. If you look uh, where you're stood, you might notice that there's an awful lot of dead people because I killed them. <laughs> and that's because they're particularly easy to shoot where... Oh, dear. I don't know if I'm missing because I'm ridic ridiculously bad at trying to shoot someone. Or uh, if I... There we go. Right. I think that's sufficient. I'm not going to check the dead bodies just yet. I'm just going to make sure that that's all the... D the ah! Run away! Hello! <laughs> right, well this is going to be an episode of me shooting things from a, from a height. Until I run out of arrows. Do you know what I... I in Morrowind, uh, in fact in the Elder Scrolls games, there's very, very high value a um, ammunition. An example of that is the Darts of Judgment. You, in Generally, in Morrowind, when you use uh, an arrow, it, you lose it. You've lost it forever. You fire it off. That was one of the cool things, one of the cool things about the graphics engine that runs behind Oblivion, is that if you shot into something that was wooden, for example, you your arrow would land in it and it would interact with the rest of the world rather than be uh, an attack me me an attack mechanism purely for reducing the damage of an individual. Oh crap! No 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 no! Jump back! <laughs> Jump, XM. Ah, uh, run! <laughs> run fast! Jump high! Run fast! Good! Oh no, we're out of arrows! Ah, right, we'll have to use some steel ones. I'm not fighting these guys fairly. They don't fight fair, I'm not fighting fair. Do you know other games I like apart from Thief 2? Well, I like Thief 2, yeah. I like the first Thief, which is a, a bit painful graphically for nowadays. Um, I liked. I also liked the uh, the other, the, like the last Thief game that they did. It was fun to play, but I didn't like it half as much as Thief 2. To be honest, Thief 2 was my favourite of the Thief um, games. Where is the, There's another guy on the run. I know there's another guy somewhere. Come on. 
Where you at? There you are. Where you at, bro? Stand still. You're making it very difficult to shoot. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Uh, right, do we have cure poison anywhere? <laughs> I like... I like the Legacy of Cain games, actually. They're fun. I like them. I'm just looking for a cure poison. Doesn't look like we've got one. Okay. Well, we might have a scroll of cure poison. Otherwise, we might die. I think we might die. Alright, where's that belt that, that we often use? Did we kill him? Oh, I think we did actually. <laughs> Look at all this dead dark brotherhood. I don't know how you're supposed to come down here and deal with all this. Goodness sake. Iron Viper. Oh, this guy just had a silver dagger. He didn't even have... He didn't even have a magically charged one. They're all dumber here. Which is interesting. Because in Oblivion, the Dark Brotherhood are, um... I don't care about that. Are all, all races and there's even a vampire involved and... I don't know. It's all very multicultural, very metropolitan. Do you know, and that's one thing about Oblivion that I didn't quite like. It was the whole metropolitan side of things. And I know it's the centre of the em Empire. But I think it could have been a little bit more heavy on the Imperial side, if you know what I mean. A little bit more, a little bit more Imperial and a little bit less metropolitan. I didn't quite, I didn't, I, I personally didn't like that element of uh, Oblivion. Although one thing I did like, um, which I don't know how many people noticed it, um, was that when you were closer to areas um, that were closer to the border with other regions, there was a lot more influence of that type of... Uh, I'll take that of that type of person. So, for example, when you go to the very north region, directly due north, hmm, directly due north region of uh, the of the um, of Cyrodiil, you uh, oh, are you joking? You. Uh, find that there's a very Nordic settlement. And when you go to the very far west, you find that there's a very Redguardish settlement. Are you kidding me? These videos are going really fast lately. I don't know what's going on. Whoa, 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 run, 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 do something. Run fast. Run faster. <laughs> so that was, I suppose, though, in that way, it could be quite metropolitan. Ha ha ha, you died. He's a mere apprentice. Oh, I didn't pay attention, actually, to see. Maybe if you're an apprentice, then you don't get good weapons. 
Well, we killed a lot of dudes today. A lot more than two, which was yesterday. Or oh, was it five? I think it was five. Oh, maybe we didn't kill more than two. Uh, or maybe we didn't kill more than five. I think we killed a lot, though, still. I wonder what's up here. I don't know if there's anything. Or maybe it's nothing. Like some kind of waterfall. It's quite cool. Hmm. This is Old Mornhold. Hmm. Interesting. I wonder why they buried it. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, let's save up today. Sometimes I forget to. T13. Brilliant. So, when we come back, guys, we will continue down here. We will have a great time doing that. And, um... It's going to be totally awesome. <laughs> we've got a lot of more inspectigations to do. We've got the north building and the east building. We've got this... Oh, we didn't fully flush out this area, so we'll have to go back and look at that. And then we've got to continue going on down here. Uh, I know we're just killing everything that we see, so maybe we should keep our um, rage still. Just a little bit. <laughs> just in case there's someone that we can talk to. Maybe we should uh, wait to see if they're hostile before we kill them. Although we don't think we did that with everybody in there. Who knows. Anyway, that'll be for next time though, guys. So until then, stay safe, take care of yourself, and goodbye.